Greetings from Visa Alegre. This is an ancient Maya port site that I work at here in on the north coast of the Mexican state of Quintana Roo on the Yucatan Peninsula. So I was asked to talk about what anthropology means to me. And I guess I could say, you know, uh, concisely it means everything, right? It's something that I've devoted my life to, uh, something that caught my attention as an undergrad uh, and that I've, you know, followed through obviously to the present. And it's afforded me these kinds of opportunities. I'm here at Visa Alegre for a short field season with uh, my good colleague, Dominique Rosolo, who I've been working with since grad school, who's at UC San Diego. We're here with Beverly Goodman from the University of Haifa in Israel, who's a marine geophysicist uh, and marine geoarchaeologist as well. Um, and it allows you these kind of opportunities, right, to work with people from all over the world who are super smart, doing really cool stuff and collaborating. And, and in our project, we're trying to understand you know, how the people who lived here, the ancient Maya who lived here, made a living, and, and how the shifting environment and social and political factors, uh, how, how they navigated those, right, and, and how those impacted the decisions they could make, you know, created opportunities or maybe constrained choices that they had. And, uh, and it's a really, it, it's a privilege to be able to work down here, uh, working with the local community. We're trying to, to get a community museum going to help kind of share what we're learning with the community and with tourists that pass through this area. So, um, you know, uh, anthropology, again, as we like to say at, at GSU, it's the major for every career. Uh, and I've taken it down the archaeology path, studying what life was like for people, you know, hundreds and thousands of years ago, but, uh, you know, all sorts of obviously different applications. And we have cultural anthropologists who work with us trying to help us navigate relations in the present, you know. Uh, and so it, it really is, a, I think, a, a fascinating uh, major for you if you're, you know, a little bit adventurous and, and willing to kind of get out of your comfort zone and, uh, and get to experience some of these just fantastic things that the world has to offer. So uh, I guess that's what anthropology means to me, and I'm pretty happy that this is what I've done with my life.